Hey everybody, I have a TBI tip that I think everybody will find useful, whether they are screen reader users or they are just a sighted TBI who's frustrated with this protected view pop-up that comes on your screen when you've downloaded a document uh, or a an Excel spreadsheet or a PowerPoint from an attachment through Outlook or if you've downloaded it from the internet, it um, automatically puts you in this protected view. So I'm gonna show you how to uh, navigate to that pop-up window using a screen reader if you're not a mouse user. And to do that, I'm going to turn on my JAWS speech settings. Full speech. And when I press F6, it will toggle me through the different regions on the screen. F6, document pane, message bars, protected view, be careful, M dash files from so I'm in that message bar now. Enable editing button. I hit tab and it moved me to enable editing. Edit, enable editing. If I didn't get there with my first F6, I could just toggle through the different, the ribbon and the status bar at the bottom, and it would eventually get me here. And then I can just turn on editing for this document. Microsoft Word document. I'm going to turn speech settings off now speech on demand. and show you another way that you can permanently disable that feature. So I'm going to file and scrolling down that navigation pane to more. Uh, depending on your computer setup, you may not have to hit more. You may just go straight to options. If you need to go into more, it'll be down there. Then you're going to navigate down on the navigation pane again to trust center. If you're navigating with a screen reader, you'll hit tab to go into the main region of this pop-up window and then tab again to get to trust center settings. And then you'll press enter to activate that. Once you're in trust center navigate or trust center settings, you will navigate to protected view. And then there are tab in. If you're using a screen reader, there are some check boxes you can disable. I'm going to choose to disable protect and disable protected view for files originating from the internet because I don't download files unless I know they're safe. I'm going to keep on enable protected view for files located in potentially unsafe locations just so I have that layer of security on my computer. And then I'm going to uncheck the box for enabling protected view for Outlook attachments. I'm not going to open something from somebody I haven't um, checked to verify. So I will press OK. If you're using a screen reader, you'll tab to OK, activate that. You have to tab again if you're using a screen reader to OK and close that out. And now the next time you open something that's protected, as long as it's from a trusted source, uh, you will not have that message window um, showing you that it's in protected view. So that should save you some time. Or if you're a screen reader user who didn't know how to get into that message window, now you know you can navigate by region.